I want to do this, how to fly through space using astrophotography. It's a video by Shivering Cactus and he uses Photoshop and Adobe After Effects. I don't have either of those. I have GIMP and DaVinci. So I'm trying to figure out if I can do those things without having to buy a trial version for work. So first things first, it's a Photoshop plugin called Content Aware Fill, and GIMP's alternative is called Resynthesizer. There's three files that Shivering Cactus provides for this tutorial. This is one of them. This is the, the image from Astrobloke. Yeah, so here's the folder. This is what is easily doable in the Photoshop plugin Content Aware Fill. You can see that the nebula is gone. The thing that actually works is this right here. This is the thing that works. You click this, it'll take you here and you download it. When you click on this thing, it'll give you two folders, plugins and scripts, plugins. It'll give you another folder, resynthesizer. You keep that and it'll give you the one application. And then it'll also give you scripts and it'll give you all these scripts. And so you take these two, uh, top level folders and put them in their respective places in users, app data, roaming, GIMP 3.0, plugins and scripts. Keep this, you have to keep this folder. You have to keep the resynthesizer folder that you downloaded. Don't unpack it. Just drag this into plugins or uh, copy paste it. What I don't know, because I did this really fast, is if you need this one, you might need this one too. And this one gives you something extra. Um, I think these are all the same, but this one gives you GUI. I think you need that, I'm not sure. Try it with just this guy first. Important thing, you have to right click on all of these properties. Um, it will say like choose your default property and you click GIMP and then under attributes there will be an extra thing that says unblock and you need to check that box and hit OK for everything in this folder. That is very important. Uh, in scripts I also did that. I don't know if that's necessary but again you right click select your what it opens with, because it won't be GIMP by default probably. And attributes, check, unblock, and then hit OK. After all that's installed, open GIMP. Here's the imported file without doing anything to it. And then you hit the select tool. Uh, and you want to get as close as possible, but this is just a quick thing. Select it, and then filters, resynthesize, heal. And I just went for the defaults and you wait for it to synthesize. Okay, and this is the final image with a very quick uh, selection. This is what the image now looks like. And this is what supposedly, where is it? Supposedly this is what it would look like with Photoshop's tool, which is, it looks cleaner to me, but if I didn't know that there was supposed to be something right here, I wouldn't guess that. So it does the job and that's it.